Hi guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Felicia, everybody calls me Flick. In today's video, I am testing out the Beauty Bay and Disney colour collection. I have been sent the Cheshire Cat palette and also all six of the shadow sticks. So yeah, I wasn't expecting an email for that. So um, that was a lovely surprise. So yeah, that is, that is today's video, testing out that creating this uh seeing how we get on with it all and i can't remember what else i was gonna say my has gone blank cool but yeah if you want to see how i created this look how i got on with the palette and the shadow sticks and all the swatches and stuff which i will put up next then yeah keep on watching okay so here are the swatches of the shadow sticks so going from like the yellow down we have got Dumbo Hat, Cheshire Cat Fur, Mad Hatter Tongue, Dumbo Sky, Mad Hatter Face, and what was that last one? Jungle, I think it was Jungle Sky, I think. Uh, but yeah, these are the Shadow Six. As you can see, the third and fifth ones have like a shimmer to them, but the rest of them are matte. Okay, so here we have the palette swatches <clears throat> from the pink down to the blue. We have Cheshire Cat Stripe, Cheshire Cat Fur, Cheshire Cat Face, uh, Eyes, Teeth and Tree. Um, this is the Cheshire Cat palette, so I don't know why I kept saying that, but yeah. Um, didn't swatch the greatest, but as we know, swatches don't really hold that much. It's kind of all about how they perform on the eyes, so yeah. Right, so I'm here. This eye is primed. So, I'm trying to think about how I want to do this. I think I've worked it out, not 100%, but I'm going to take the pink first um, and I'm going to put that on a fluffy blur. Wow, okay, that's gone on a lot more pigmented than I thought it would after the swatches. Tap it on and then buff it a bit. Okay. Then, do I want to take that brush? I'm going to take this little pencil brush. I'm going to take the mm, that purple. Um, I'm going to put that maybe a bit more. Put that, just dab it on the outer corner. Actually, I'm going to put it on the inner corner as well. I'm going to go back in with that pink. No, this isn't the most creative thing ever. I am just playing as I go. I'm then going to take the yellow shadow stick, the Dumbo hat, and and then I'm going to smudge that in. I use this. So I use my PC39 just to put it on the brush. Then I'm going to take that little purple again, just go over the edges where I've applied the yellow. I'm 
I'm going to take that brush again, but I'm going to take the darker, like burgundy type shade, just a little bit, just to deepen up the inner and outer corners a bit. take that fluffy brush again but I'm actually going to take the white shade at the bottom very lightly just around that edge I'm going to try and use as many shades in this as I can so far I have used four out of five I might take that yellow actually and apply that over the top of the shadow stick so make sure that's clean So that's how that's looking right now. Um, obviously there is no shimmers in this. The blue I'm gonna use on the underneath, I think. But yeah, there's no shimmers in this palette, which throws me um, because we all know how much I like shimmer on my lids. So it's throwing me a little bit that there isn't a shimmer shade. But yeah, I'm gonna go do the other eye throw on some liner and lashes and do everything else and we'll see where we're at. Right. I am back. We are going to do this under eye. I used the shadow stick in Dumbo Sky which is the light blue. Uh, I did this on my waterline, in my waterline, on, in. And also underneath as well and just kind of smudged it out. And then I'm going to take this little brush I've got in a needle set and I'm going to smudge the underneath out. Make sure I'm still in frame. Okay, then I am going to take my little pointy brush from BH and I'm going to take the blue, the dark, dark blue, tap it off. And I'm going to place it underneath and I'm also going to like wing it out. See, I did it. I want to re, re drag it out on that side after I have to redo my liner because uh, I screwed it up. Apparently, I can't do liner today. Slightly. Going to take this brush. Is it clean? I think it's clean. Yeah, I'm going to take the white just along it on that outer edge just to help it a little bit yeah cool all right so just put on some mascara on that lower lash i'm going to use my was it w7 absolute lashes it's a little mini it's a dupe for the benefit one that i've just finished the reel i didn't like the audi version of this i like this one better it's I wish I'd shown you before I put my lashes on, actually. There you go. Done. Um, yeah, apparently I can't, I completely screwed up my liner on this side today and I tried to correct it. But if I'm honest, it ain't looking too hot. Just 
try and make sure it's all blended and buffed and not as noticeable even though it totally is and what that is gonna have to do I need to throw some lips on which I might as well do oh, I can use my new P. Louise ones yeah, I've got itchy nose right there okay so I bought two new P. Louise lip paints I got semi nude and baby or bougie so I will just swatch them on the back of my arm on my hand even it's a really nice pink one and then I've got semi nude I kind of feel like I will wear the pink, or I'll probably wear the nude. So top one is semi-nude, bottom one is baby or bougie. I now have four of these. Um, I kind of want to use the pink, but I'm, I might, no, I'm not. I don't know, let's get a wipe, wipe that off before they set and don't come off. Uh, liner, lip liner, oh my God. PLC, no, I want my Actually, no. I'm gonna go in with my, my also, no, faithful P. Louise liner. Okay, I may overline a little bit more after. Take a lip brush. And I'm gonna take semi nude. I might dab a little bit of bagel bougie in the middle. Well, my lips are dry as hell. That is a really nice colour. Like that. Joe, you know I think I'm just gonna leave it as semi-nude. Yeah, I am. Sorry, baby bougie, you'll be used another day. Okay, apart from oh okay. inner corner highlight and um, brow bone highlight, I'm done. So let's just whack that on real quick and then we're done. I'm gonna take the Beauty Bay flash highlighter I've tried to use as much Beauty Bay as I can today out uh, of what I own just because it just seemed logical okay there we go <clears throat> we are done let me just zoom you out. Mm. Okay, obviously my hair's a mess and I'm not dressed. I need to do that. But, I, actually this has turned out okay. I was really doubtful for a minute. I did not think this was gonna go well at all. But, I don't mind it at all. I'm not used to having all matte shadows. I always incorporate a shimmer somewhere or glitter or something so to not have a shimmer shadow in the palette just yeah don't know how I feel about that it's lovely and it's performed fine doesn't top the other ones that I own though like my uh, matte brights uh, book of magic opulence all of those size ones it's really lovely but it doesn't like touch them they still reign supreme as far as my beauty bay palettes are concerned so yeah 
Thank you very much Beauty Bay for sending me these. I wasn't expecting the whole thing of shadow sticks, I was just expecting like two or three. Um, so thank you, um, I really do appreciate it and I've had great fun trying that as you can see. But yeah, I will obviously link everything in the description box below for you. You can buy these in little sets, I think you can buy them in the character sets. So, um, we'll see I've got the Cheshire Cat palette. Um, and I was expecting to get maybe like the Cheshire Cat or Alice in Wonderland themed uh, shadow six, but I did get all six, so very much appreciate that. I did actually really like the way that those were formed. Once they are on, they do not bite. When I swatch them, they don't want to come off my arm at all. Um, so yeah, these are these are quite good, but uh, yeah, that is all I have to say on the matter. I am going to go sort my hair out get dressed take some lovely pictures film an intro remember to do this that this time and then what time are we at an hour and a half till my daughter finishes nursery so yeah do any little jobs i've got to do before then and that is me done for the day i shall be back in this chair tomorrow filming um because my p louise budget box is arriving tomorrow so that will be the next video to go up so yeah very very excited i hope you guys liked this video i hope you enjoyed it if you did please do not forget to like subscribe smash the notification bell clicking all so you don't miss any uploads and leave me a comment down below let me know if you've tried any of this if you want to try any of these there's a whole range of these palettes now so yeah i think there's bambi dumbo cheshire cat jungle book i can't remember how many there are in total but there's quite a few so yeah leave me a comment down below and let me know i am gonna love you and leave you please do not forget to also go and hit the socials i nearly repeated myself then because i forgot i already said it but no socials are up here also linked down below in the description box along with my patreon that i have now created and also my amazon storefront i have been granted access to that um lovely feature on amazon now so yeah all my favorite bits that i bought bleh, buy on there are also linked through there so yeah i'm gonna love you and leave you and i'll see you in the next one